I would say the most rewarding part of working here at Armored One is the mission that we stand behind, which is saving lives. My name is Tino Amwade. I'm the Chief Technical Officer and co-founder of Armored One. We started back in uh, 2012, right after Sandy Hook. We were just a bunch of pissed off dads who really wanted to do something different and make change in our schools. And so we started a company called Armored One, which has become a life-saving company. And we develop products and services to prepare people and buildings if there should be an active shooter event. We're not driven by success. We're driven by results. We're driven by the results of the fact that we have had a school that was attacked. And our products and our services and our assessments and our training that went into that school was the reason why that school didn't have a single person that was injured and the guy never made it any further than the front entrance way. I think it's important for any business to be a huge part of their local community. For Armored One here, we're in the, we're in the city of Syracuse. We're in Onondaga County. And we've kind of taken on the mission not only to save lives, but also to kind of revitalize the area. So we purchased the old Lennox Furnace Factory, which is a building from the 19, I think it was early 1900s. Having the ability to bring those manufacturing jobs in to revitalize kind of an area that hasn't been the greatest has been a huge part of what we wanted to do. And then also the support that we get from the community, knowing that we're here for the right reasons and doing the right things. And ultimately what our goal is, is that we want to make it to the point where we can be so proactive and help people prepare for active shooters that one day Armored One isn't needed. And the only way we're ever going to get by and ever achieve something is working together. So it's not about what Armored One does, it's really about the partnerships that we've created.